What is going on guys? Today I'm going to be watching and reacting to The Boys Season 2 Finale, which is titled What I Know. So excited to jump into this. I just got done watching episode 7, like I literally just finished it. And it ended off with that crazy cliffhanger of everyone's head, or most people's head, in the courtroom hearing, getting their heads just blown off. Um, really curious to see what exactly happened there. I just, I, I'm not going to even talk about anything before this episode because I just want to jump into this as soon as I possibly can. If you want us to do full and cut reaction, that'll be my Patreon, which is in the description down below, as well as early access to these videos. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Let's watch this. And I'm here with Homelander to talk about school safety. <laughs> On the first report of an active supervillain, I hear it will immediately rush to your campus. Arm yourselves. Your teacher should have an authorized firearm. What is that gonna do against a superhero, though? Look, there was no terrorist. It was Vought. It's a fucking coup. A bunch of their guys died, too. To cover their own tracks. But you've got no proof. Folks are scared. If Vought took a shit in the that middle of Fifth true. Avenue through a ticker tape parade. Here's what we do have, Bob. Oh, let me guess. A tape of me fucking my kid's nanny at her daughter's <laughs> quinceanera. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, she's running off. I mean, I would too. The kid's gone, so what? Yeah. Now they're just gonna probably capture her. What is that little knife gonna do against all those guys? The RPG releases an electromagnetic pulse on impact. Should cut through stone from plasma balls. You think? Thanks to Starlight, we know that Noir needs any fucking trainer. <laughs> okay, so he's not dead. That's just okay. So, wouldn't he tell Maeve? That wouldn't he? Wouldn't he uh, rat out Maeve? Why is Maeve still like hanging out with Vought? We're just gonna shoot right runner in the fucking head. That won't stop Vought. That that won't stop Compound V. If you kill these soups, then Vought's just gonna make a thousand more. That is true. Vought attacked the country, Huey. Fuck them all. Yeah, well, I agree, but that's not like a. What if I... You guys are just people. That's the bar. Unresponsive. Oh, he's unresponsive. That's why he hasn't read it out, maybe yet. You didn't do this. I wish I'd killed Vogelbaum. Yeah, I thought so. There's no way she could do that. And that means. Is Edgar? Maybe. We have to make sure that the right people get the doses, but it is a whole new world. What about the wrong people? He doesn't want someone to be more powerful than him. This isn't gonna work. This is not gonna stop Compound V from getting out there. So it's hopeless? I say move to another country, a very non-populated country, and just live there the rest of your life. Out in the woods somewhere. Why did you save me at the tower? They were they're gonna hurt you. Yeah, but Huey, you could have gotten yourself killed. I just... Would never. That's why I'm helping. You're our last chance. Pass. Look, I get that it's dangerous. It's suicide. I'm tired. We're all tired. But they're hurting people. And sooner or later, they're gonna hurt someone you love. Am I talking to you? <sighs> I get. That it's easier to just disappear inside of yourself. But we can't, Maeve. We can't. This is a war now. Shut and the we fuck up. Christ, you are he lives under a contract and you slap like Becca. Let her in. Fucking me. She found him. <laughs> they took him. Wow. I'm surprised she got there. I'm sorry. Okay, I have no right to ask you to help me after what I said to you, but... Look, don't you worry, all right? I will find your son. He still loves you. He doesn't care. <laughs> Fuck off, you look. <laughs> Mr. Edgar, normally I wouldn't put this through. The man says it's life or death and you know him. What's his name? William Butcher. Oh, shit. How about we take a field trip? What do you say, Dad? Planet Vought. Oh, that looks fun. <laughs> People are really just hanging out at, at Vought things right now after everything that just happened. I would be, like, scared to leave my home. Oh, God. Too many people. Excuse me. Stay back, please. 
please, 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 just stay back. No, no, I'm an asshole for bitching about my mom when you're just... My mom's not dead. She's not? Oh, really? Oh, it's just you never mentioned her, so... She I assumed... I assumed she was. <laughs> what? Hey, I saved your life, asshole. Now you're coming after us. Is he gonna he's gonna wanna team up with them now? Cause he's gonna wanna take down Stormfront? We're even now, bitch. I wouldn't call it even. You did kill his girlfriend, but Holy shit. Yeah, he's helping. Where did you get this? I didn't get it. Okay. I was never here. You got that shit on your own, yeah? But what? Wh why are you doing this? Because I want back in. So I need her gone. It's all about Stormfront, I see. Perfect. Leak it to the public. That's all you gotta do is leak it to the public. Homelander's a friend. Why would I betray him? Because you're a ruthless bastard. That's hurtful. You turned a racist <laughs> piece of shit into America's sweetheart. Stormfront's good at making people angry. Angry people want Compound B. Compound B raises our stock price. Oh, that's his reasoning for that. Okay. He just like Gus, like so similar. His motivations are all like business related. When I got him, I'll call your people. They zero in on this cell signal, and then come and scoop him up, and then you. Do a bit of fucking job of hiding them this time, yeah? You have my word. <laughs> All right. I will get Rebecca and Ryan somewhere safe. No. Not Becca. Becca stays with me. But that's the whole point. That he's raised by his mother. Find him a new fucking mum. Oh my Take god. My wife back. Yeah, that's Becca's not gonna be down for that, that though, Butcher. Did you find anything? They got him in a cabin up in Rochester. Of course we're in. It's nice to see them all, like, Good with each other right now. There's no arguing, you know. They they're they're always arguing here and there, but they've been pretty chill this episode. I need you to promise me something. I need you to promise me that you will save him no matter what, and you will get him back to me. I don't know. If it was not Homelander's son, then I think he would. If there's one thing I know. Is that you can take care of yourself. I do hope if Stormfront dies this episode, I hope Kamiko does it. I hope that's foreshadowing. I hope Kamiko gets to do it. And we're gonna need people like you to protect our kind. All right. So they better succeed in taking this kid out of here. But you gotta be fucking kidding me. I don't know. What? Oh. What? They, yeah, the stuff leaked. Oh shit, they're here. They're near. Uh, I'm assuming they're near because they're in the woods. Oh god. Who is she going to, Edgar? I can't believe I actually have to say this this day and age, but Nazis are bad. Oh my god, people already made this in like two seconds? Holy shit, this plan. This plan is insane. Grab him and go. This is so dangerous, dude. Holy shit. Oh, he better. Oh, he's gonna make a. Okay, good, 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 good. I thought he was gonna cause problems. Good. Go. Get the fuck out of there with someone fucking hugging. We gotta go. There's literally no time for this. There's no time for this. Butcher, you better not do some shit. Oh, they're not supposed to come back here. Take my car. Get them both to Mallory. Butcher, what are you gonna do? I cut a deal with Stan Edgar. I cut a deal that when I got Ryan, that I would call Vought, they were gonna come and take him away, and that you'd never fucking see him again. Fuck me, I, I couldn't do it. Holy shit. The concept, Vought. <laughs> Did I hear you say butcher? Do you have the boy? Oh, you all are dead. 
Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Where's my son? Oh shit. Oh. Where is my son? I'm not. I'm not leaving here without you. I don't care. Who's gonna sell you out? A fucking one might do it again. You, you didn't, though. And you didn't, and you won't. You can't have a cunt like me around that kid. I don't want to my shit on him. Butcher's actually having some self-awareness. You can't be doing this right now. Please. You gotta let me do this. You gotta let me do this one fucking thing. I appreciate Butcher for doing that, though. No! No! Oh my god. Holy shit. There you are, you slippery little bitch! Kamiko, fuck her up. Kamiko, fuck her up. Oh, they got Kamiko and Starlight. I swear, Becca better be alright. Okay, she's okay. I'm assuming Ryan's okay too. Yo, we gonna get a fight here. Oh shit. Kamiko, you might be able to do it, I don't know. She's really powerful though. <laughs> First time I've heard a laugh. <laughs> and what are you laughing at? I don't know what her plan is. She says the truth is. She's gonna stick her boot up your Nazi kitty. <laughs> Damn! Oh, <laughs> Huey and Frenchie, you guys are. Oh yeah, yeah, the RPG. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Fucking her up. Oh no, 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 no. 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 Wait, is she dead? I don't. Did that kill her? I, I heard a snap. Hey, Kraut. Maeve? Oh, she's a. I forgot it's Kamiko. I forgot that she can heal pretty easily. <laughs> I, I, I keep. I, I forget that, you know, she could definitely take that. Damn. This is great. <laughs> this is great. <laughs> oh, of course. Yeah, she's gonna be too hard to kill, that's the problem. Oh, he went to town. I really thought Kamiko was dead there for a second. I forgot that a little neck snap's not gonna kill her. <laughs> she would need to get, like, blown up to die, probably. Oh no. Ow. Come on, Ryan. Holy shit! That little knife came in handy. <laughs> no, no, no. Stop, stop, this episode's insane. That's not gonna do anything. She's gonna die. Ryan. Do something, Ryan. Yes, Ryan, come on, do something. Yes! Blast her fucking head off. I, I think he did it. I think she's dead. I hope he killed her, right? I... Oh, she's in fucking pieces. <laughs> Holy shit. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Mom. No, no, don't kill. No, no. No. Oh, shit. Hold on. Help us! Somebody help us! Make sure he knows that. Yeah. He's good. He's good. 
You promise me you keep him safe. Oh my god. Oh shit. That's terrible. He got her back just for this to happen. This is definitely the best episode of the series, by the way. Oh, he's never gonna... No. Butcher's gonna hate the shit out of this kid. Yeah, Butcher's not forgiving him. There's no way. Oh my god, Butcher, what the fuck are you gonna do? No, no, okay, you, no, it wasn't his fault. Take your anger out on Homelander and Vaught. Not a kid. Oh shit. The fuck are you saying? Ryan? Did you do this? I didn't mean to. Is Butcher still there? I'd be surprised why he wouldn't kill Butcher. Come. Oh shit, Butcher is there. Are you gonna blow yourself up? You save the little shit that fucking murdered your wife? I promise. Have it your way. Stop. Oh, nice. You're gonna let them go. And if I don't? Don't die with them. Oh, shit. Let them go. I'll destroy everything and everyone. Great. As long as everyone sees what a fucking monster you are. Yeah, he would kill everyone. <laughs> no, I don't know if he would, because then he wouldn't have people to yeah, he wouldn't have he wouldn't have people to love him anymore. He would just be all alone, and that's his worst nightmare is being alone. Dude, season three's gotta be insane. They're really leaving us off on a everything's just so different. We believe that Stormfront was a sole perpetrator of the attack on Washington. They're making her... It makes sense. I would personally like to apologize to Starlight, who was wrongfully accused of sabotage. <laughs> Look at his pupils. <laughs> Stormfront's been critical of the church for a long time, and Vought needs to take a firm anti-Nazi stance right now. Wait, does that mean... I just spoke to Stan Edgar. You're back in. Oh, wow. Maybe I am too clingy. No, you're not. Sticking with people just because I'm terrified of losing them, I, I, I can't do that anymore. I think it's time I go off, stand on my own two feet for once. Right, um, yeah, no worries. Well, um... That's not what you wanted to hear. We'll just be friends then. Oh, oh God, no, 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 I'm still gonna cling on to you. I'm not fucking crazy. <laughs> now, remember what I told you. Don't be a cunt. He's not sticking with him. I guess he's safer with the CIA, so. That wrapped things up really nicely. Oh, he's getting to see his family. I love this song. Is he just jerking off? <laughs> what a sicko. Call my office, set up a meeting. You are one of the good ones, Vic. Oh! Uh, who the fuck's doing this? Who is this? What? 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 You're kidding me. Oh, that is a fucking hell of a twist. She seems so nice. <laughs> Holy shit. Hugh Campbell. I don't know how to repay you for what you did. She's been blowing plenty of heads. 
This woman's power uh, power is really dangerous. Blowing brains, just no one will know, ever know it's her. She can do it with ease. When can you start? She might be the most powerful soup. She could just kill anyone. Like, wow. Fantastic episode. Like I said, easily the best episode of this whole series thus far. I really loved season two. I think I like it more than season one just by a little bit. They're pretty close, though. They're both really fantastic. But I fucking love this season. They've added a lot of new things that... I mean, it really was just continuation, really. It wasn't like it was a whole new story, but the addition of Stormfront was probably one of the bigger storylines that had a lot of importance to the season, and I love that they killed her off at the end of the season. I didn't want to see that go into season three, but I did like a lot of the stuff they did with her character and the story surrounding that, and especially Homelander and her and how that kind of thing went, how they like hate each other at first, and then they were like unseparable. It was just it was just this really just you know gross combination of people and um loved the stuff with becca this season as well with butcher butcher's character i think has probably had the most time to shine this season out of anyone he's had a lot of more development we've learned a lot more about him i actually have more sympathy for him now and i actually think he's not a terrible person the way i kind of thought he was at the beginning of the season because he's done a lot of shitty things and he still continues to do shitty things but he definitely redeemed himself at least for me at the end of the season and um just a lot of the seasons we've been learning more about him, and I think he's been becoming a better, better person as the series is kind of going along. So I'm really enjoying that. Huey and Starlight, same same as season one. They were probably my favorites in season one. Uh, they definitely still had a lot of time to shine this season, especially in this episode. That scene with uh, Starlight, Kimiko, and Maeve uh, beating the shit out of Stormfront was probably one of the best scenes in the whole show. <laughs> and then the confrontation afterwards with ryan getting his own mother killed but obviously also killing stormfront was was just so good i actually teared up that was the first time i've teared up in this entire show um was when butcher was crying over her death that was incredibly sad because he's been working so hard to get her back and then for her to just die by her own son on accident like that is just so fucked up and it was just all around incredible so let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Up next, of course, is season three. I will be starting it. I'm not sure if I'll start it as soon as possible. I might wait a little bit, but maybe I will. I'm not sure. I'm probably going to do a couple of movies in between then and just give like at least a week or two break before we jump into season three. Don't forget to check out the full uncut reaction on my Patreon, which links in the description. Also, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.